Welcome to Shopify Mechanics. Today, David has a question about issuing store credit. How can I issue store credit to a customer when they do a product return? Let's go into our Shopify orders and find one to perform a refund. Click into the order to start the return process. If you don't see the return button, then first check if the line items are fulfilled. And don't forget, orders have to first be fulfilled before you can issue a return in Shopify. So if you don't see the return button, that means you have to wait for the fulfillment to be completed. For now, we'll manually create the fulfillment. We'll quickly do that now. Once you've fulfilled the line items, you can start issuing returns and refunds for those products. You'll now see the return button is available. Click here to select which items need to be returned. Use the increment buttons to quickly select the quantity. If you're doing an exchange, you can select that product. Since we're only doing a return, we won't do an exchange at this time. You can also choose the return shipping options. We'll choose no shipping for this example. However, your store policy may be different. You can now create the return. We're not issuing the refund yet since we haven't confirmed the product return. Depending on your return policy, make sure the customer first returns the item before you issue the refund. Once you've confirmed receipt of the items, you can now safely issue the refund to the customer. At this point, you'll process the refund in Shopify. You can choose to restock the item and decide if you want to also refund the shipping. You can also choose to conduct the refund now or at a later time. We'll choose to issue the refund now. And here's where this cool new Shopify feature comes into play. You can now select to issue the refund as a store credit for that customer. The store credit amount will be pre-selected in the field to match the refund amount. You can also choose to issue a different amount. When you've selected the desired amount, just process the refund. That's it. You've now issued store credit to that user. The customer can use the credit online or in-store. If you want to confirm the amount, click on the customer and check their store credit totals. The Shopify customer administration provides a complete log of all customer credits and debits. Using store credits in Shopify is now easier than ever. And of course, customers love the convenience. Thanks, that seems easy. I'll be using store credits more often now to support my customers. Thanks for watching. Contact us with your Shopify questions.